Hello, Ayubu and Wanakkam. Assalamu alaikum. So, we are back with another breaking news here that happened today morning. I think the news here is that Paul Fabris then Alut Sri Lanka Poonukaro. New uh, Alut Poonukaro when our Sri Lanka cricket condame. So, late uh, breakers, uh, breaking news for Paul Fabris, the World Cup, uh, I mean, the World Cup winning coach of the 2014-2020 World Cup and the Asia Cup is set to take over reigns of Sri Lanka cricket um, after the Australia tour. That's the news coming out. Up, So there were three main candidates, I think, for Sri Lanka beforehand. I think Lance Klusner, uh, uh, Courtney Walsh and um, Blackburn from uh, New Zealand. Bradburn from New Zealand, sorry. But Mangita ne tunde naam then ibat pela tiene Sri Lanka hitu hitue alut vide mang local puno karu karu ek kona they wanted a local new coach but apparently now Sri Lanka interested to uh, invest on a foreign coach. Uh, why didn't they then um, uh, give a new two year contract to Miki Atta? That was the simple case, right? Then the tibba ne Miki Atta the thava aurudu deka. Yeah, it's a unanduing on a muna Sri Lanka kanda me improve karana thava aurudu dekak then SLC, but the SLC no, they, they can't give a two year contract to Miki Atta. End of story. I know I did criticize uh, Miki Atta, especially in the England tour. I accept that. I admit that I did criticize. But they, at the end, I saw that there was some good performance from the Sri Lanka team. And uh, moving forward to the 2023 World Cup, 2022 2020 World Cup, we did a visit to the local Kusalane, Miki Atta, uh, Paul Fabry sitting up with Dano Yagi record deca. There were more than 30, um, there were more than 30 applicants um, for the head coach, and Fabrice has not applied. Now, this is the craziest story here. Paul Fabrice has apparently not applied to the head coach. Brilliant, brilliant by the cricket uh, advisory committee. What happened to the rest of the 30, uh, 30 members? Apidane, Apidane Mukadune Gila. Um, and then, um, so they have said former head coach is by island.lk you know uh, Daniel Alexander right the journalist I think he must have written this let's see who wrote this uh, oh sorry by Rex uh, Clementine okay Rex is uh, Rex is a reliable uh, journalist oh yeah Gilatine Graham for Tamai overwhelming choice thing yeah Tamai most likely yeah, Tame uh, in Tibbe uh, 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 Punukaru when Sri Lanka cricket can name have a Prashne Venatini at Chutta Kamaru Velatina, Visa Hambuene at permanently move Karana Kolamata, Chutta Kamaru Velatina. I think uh, so. We know under Graham Ford, Sri Lanka whitewash Australia 3 0 test at home, and yeah, and he departed from the Sri Lanka cricket team back in 2017. Fabris mean my Fabris ya yanne Australia then visa visa pahak tiye no iting eka eka ta Rumesh Ratna eka tamai intermin coach venne thamat iting oka tamai vila tiye ne and the island has told the SLC has told Fabris to see through to his contract because not many coaches have been that lucky with the SLC when the board uh, board ending their terms uh, uh, permanently so uh, Geoff Marsh has gone to courts apparently in 2012 for talk, uh, termination of employment so yeah and former trace cricketer navid navas also will be joining the head uh, national team as assistance to fabrice eko honda honda uh, news ega keko honda tatwayak uh, navid ramas api dannawa ya bangladesh ya daname pala kandayame uh, poonu karamuna cricket uh, daname pala egolu dinna 2019 e age poonu karu vela I think that's a good addition. Navi Navas to the Bang, uh, to the Sri Lanka national cricket team. It's positive news, very positive news. And he's expected to um, yeah till the end of the year only for uh, Navi Navas. But for Paul Fabris, it will be a two-year uh, role. And the cricket advisory committee con uh, consists of Kumar Sangakkara, Aravind De Silva, and Muttaiya Mulidharan. And they wanted a New Zealand apparently to get a role. My God, I don't know the drama happening. So apparently forget about that. Paul Fabris, um, he was appointed coach previously in 2013. in December. So uh, I think Sri Lanka uh, lost the series 3-2 ODI series. But um, drew the test series against Pakistan. Bangladesh, I think they uh, easily won. The 2020 matches and the uh, test series asia cup they have won and the 2020 world cup until he left to england 
to be the assistant coach under uh, Tom Mo uh, Peter Moore sorry T Peter Moore yeah so ek thamai tattwe thile Sri Lanka then theri then balanawa Paul Fabrice wa alut poonu karu wenna Sri Lanka cricket kannai so Paul Fabrice is likely to become the new head coach of sri lanka cricket is in many sources and come from the island cricket and from rex who is a very very reliable um, journalist so that's it please do subscribe to sports play dong please click the notification bell on for more updates on sri lanka cricket and world cricket we'll be coming back soon tomorrow most probably tomorrow or day after see you guys until then